Back again with another video, baby. Yes, so wow, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Bruce Manchester. Back again with another banger video for y'all, you know what I'm saying. Now, today I'm doing another animation video, you know what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying. Uh, shout out to my boy, Timeless Team, for helping me make this video, you know what I'm saying. Check out his channel, Banger Stories, Banger Animations, you know what I'm saying. This man. The grinding lifetime story, none, no cap shit, you know what I'm saying? This man legit. So today I'm checking out the day he fought a girl. I don't know how he did it. I don't know. He took some rights. One, two, three. Knock her out. The day he, I don't know. He got knocked out. She got knocked out. I don't know. Maybe he didn't go down. Maybe he went, maybe he went sideways. I don't know. So let's check out the video, you know what I'm saying? So let's get it. Yeah. Nigga, what? Uh, now I know what you're thinking. Damn, damn. a girl? Oh, no, 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 my guy. How'd that happen? Well, here we go. Damn. Man, this shit, I like the way it starts like Marvel, man. I love that creativity, man. This guy, the grinding. Look at this. It's starting like Marvel, man. Timeless team. Before we get started, I've got one question for you. Do you really know how to fight? See, some people think they can throw them hands until it's too late. But see, there is one way to know, and that's martial arts. See the term you know my martial boy can't arts, fight. You know your boy can't fight. system of training for combat that have been systemized. Now, these different systems or styles Go are no. all designed for one purpose, and that purpose is fighting. Now, as you know, some forms of martial arts are used for sport, others for entertainment. But then we have the ones that are used for the sole purpose of self-defense. Self now, as a kid, I tried basketball, football, right. soccer. But there's one thing that I've always wanted to do. The one thing my parents would never let me try. And that's martial arts. Damn, damn, damn. I already Ooh. know. Damn. I thought you did call Rate as a kid. I sure did. Man, we both know how that turned out. But I'm talking the real gladiator man combat. So for this story, I'm going to take you back. Back to my post-teen years. So one Saturday morning, I was pumping gas at the local gas station. Right. Now, as usual, every Saturday morning, I would get gas, drive to the local gym, and pump these guns. You know what I'm but saying? this day, something changed. See, halfway through pumping some gas, a guy walked up to me and handed me a pamphlet for a new open MMA gym. Now, usually I'm no fan of reading handouts, but this particular pamphlet caught my attention. Yes, see, sir. The top of the pamphlet, it said, become the next world champion. See, this, this was a sign from God. See, back then, mixed martial arts wasn't as popular as it is today. So finding a local gym was really hard to do and expensive. But just think about it. This was made for me. I've always wanted to be a martial artist. Yeah, man. And suddenly, I got the answers right in front of me. Sounds like divine intervention to me. So I put the address on my phone, drove to the local gym, which was only a 15-minute ride from the crib. So I get there, get in. First thing I noticed, this was an old beat-up gym. I mean, mm. on the pamphlet, it said brand new gym. But this certainly ain't it. You know a man's gone in your ass. And he comes at the door. Man, you putting gas in your car and a man gives in your fly. You know that guy's a con, man. There's no way it's legit. If it was legit, he'll be sticking posters around. This guy, I you can get some suspicions, man. He was in a hurry. He knew he was calling your ass. There's no way it was brand new. I'm pretty sure he didn't even give him his phone number. You know, let's get first thing first. Ain't no air conditioning and play smell like straight up musty balls. Oh hell! Smell like balls, man. No AC. Place looks like shit. Smells like balls. Smells like dog shit. And you're. No, no, no. Team peace, man. Oh, no. I ain't about to pay a monthly fee for an old beat-up building. So I monthly decided fee. to leave. Woo. But before leaving, an old man walks up to me. Hello, young man. Uh, hello? Oh, you got some guns there, man. You want to learn how to fight? Fight? Nah, not in here, old man. Really? How about this, young man? You see her right there? If you can beat that young lady right there, 
I'll give you free membership to the gym for the whole. Man, a man offers you free membership if you knock out a chick. Which, what, tell me in the comments section, what y'all gonna do? Are y'all gonna take it because I ain't gonna pay a whole fee for some cranky ass gym here. Got no AC smelling like balls. Hell no. I'm gonna knock this chick out. One, two, three, man. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that girl? Nah, I'm not doing that. I'm not finding a girl. You're not afraid of a little girl now, are you? Kid. Damn. Kid. Who's she calling a kid? No, I can't. Cat, I was feeling myself. I was easily the most ripped man in the gym world. Well, other than the fact it was only old man and shorty, but that's not the point. Look, I get it. It's cute. Old man putting baby girl against me. I mean, I'm sure she might be tough, and maybe she can even be the regular average guy. But your boy, uh, 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 uh damn. Chance, fam, call me the Dark Knight. Get it, Dark Knight? Because I'm black. Yes, for real, I have fights, fights. But my man's was persistent, so I figured since this was for free membership. Why not? I got nothing to lose, right? Gotta do I'm it. show this old geezer how to throw the hands. Now, according to him, all I had to do is take her down and make her submit. But here's the catch. I couldn't use my hands or feet to hit a kicker. Okay. Yo, what? You can't use your hands or feet. Then how are you going? No, no, no. Nicole, not a big deal. Now, I feel you. You probably thinking, uh-uh. This ain't fair, right? See, I what? believe all men are created equal when it comes to rights and beliefs. But when it comes to physical abilities, especially when it comes to combat sport, ain't no such thing as equal. Yeah, now, man. I'm no Elon Musk, but I'm sure there's a reason why males and females compete separately in the same sport. Take LeBron, for example. Put him in the WNBA. The man will dominate and average 100 points a game, win all MVPs and championships every Imagine year. Imagine that. Okay, on the other hand, take Ronda Rousey, a tough, well-known ex-UFC fighter, right? Put her in a heavyweight fight against, I don't know, Brock Lesnar. What? I think we already know how this goes But... Thing. No Contrary doubt. Contrary to popular perception, most people don't really know how to fight. If you don't believe me, just watch the next trending social media fight, and you'll see guys taking off their shirts, clapping their hands, trash talking, and you soon to realize, oh, they don't know how to fight. They just imitating what they see on television. Mm -hmm. So there we were, me and old girl, about to throw it down. Now, if you haven't noticed by now, baby girl was a jiu-jitsu black belt. Damn. Just in case you don't know, jiu-jitsu is a form of martial arts designed for the weaker or smaller opponents. See, it emphasizes on ground fighting, which gives smaller practitioners the ability to overpower much larger opponents by leveraging their bodies. Now, first of all, I'm a gentleman. Damn, I Tim, what you gonna do? wasn't gonna use my full strength. Come on, guys. What you take me for? It's a girl. If I take her seriously, I'm gonna catch a body, my guy. So we. Yo, Tim, she might be a shorty, but you gotta, gotta do something, man. I know you can throw some hands, but you gotta do something, man. You can't lose, bro. Get into position. Free membership on the ready. line. Are y'all ready? Now, when a person says, oh, are you ready? What comes to mind? You're supposed to look at the ref and give him the um good sign. So I look at the old man, and this guy immediately says, fight, with my eyes still looking at him. So I look for it. Ooh. Damn. When I say baby girl flip me over like an IHOP pancake on a Saturday morning, I hit that floor so hard. Crazy. didn't see what was Yo. coming. Match, hold up. I wasn't ready. Sorry, kid. You lost, but that's not fair. What Kate, you got bit up by a girl? Okay, now I'm mad. First, they didn't play fair. I know I wasn't ready. Second, I didn't know baby girl was a black male. See, this changes everything. But man, what do you mean you didn't know she was a black belt? She wearing a black belt. You team, team, stop playing with us, man. Stop playing with us. That's my mistake from the beginning. See, I underestimated Shorty. So like the G that I am, I took the L. But Damn. I get my payback. So the old man asked me if I wanted a rematch. But this time, I changed my strategy. See, I figured I gotta play smart. So I acted like I didn't want to go for another round. Which gave me the advantage because I knew 
old girl would drop her guard. So we get into the starting position one more time, but this time I was calm but alert, relaxed but ready, smooth and sharp. Okay, guys, Go. ready? Ha! Man, when I tell you I didn't hold back, fam, they say never hit a lady, but this. This flipped this girl so hard, caught me a body. So Damn. of the story. There is no greater danger than underestimating your opponent. What's up, world? Thank you. Yo. Damn. Legit team took him down. Took her down, man. He got the free membership. No, I'm saying. Like, share, subscribe, banger videos coming up. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you soon.